I'm sponsoring one of them starving kids. You ever done that? Let me tell you something. This is the biggest ripoff known to man, and I like to help people out, and I was doing it for three years. I was sponsoring. I adopted one of them little peckerheads down there, all right? <laughs> Seriously, let me tell you something. True story. I get a letter in the mail the other day, certified letter, all right? The kid that I adopted busted up a bunch of stuff, and I got to pay for the damages. <laughs> Seven million pygmies. I got the gang member. Ain't that something? I ought to fly down there and stick my boot up old Boobla Boobla's ass is what I ought to do. Now I got to fly down there and go to parent-teacher conferences. You believe that? What am I going to say down there? How y'all doing? <laughs> what the hell? I did get a letter from him, though. I did get a letter from Boobla Boobla. And I sent Boobla Boobla a care package. And Boobla Boobla sent me this letter back. It says here, Dear Larry the Cable Guy, thanks so much for the fly swatters. <laughs> they sure come in handy on them muggy nights. I appreciate the PlayStation, but there ain't no place to plug it in down here. Why can't they make a button that just says pass? <laughs> My brother, Booble Bobble Booble, <laughs> got hit in the head last night by a flower bag during a food drought. <laughs> He's having a rough week down there. I shrunk a missionary head last night and put it on a stick, so you'll be getting it as soon as UPS starts to deliver again down here. The last driver ended up in a kettle of taters and roots. Tomorrow we're gonna go hippo gigging. It's like frog gigging, but with hippos. Last time I hurt my back because they made me carry the decoys. Mom's all excited because they're going to show her boobs on the cover of the February National Geographic. She just rode a wild hog over to tell the neighbors. Well, I got to go. There's a lion running around in the shrubbery. And if you ain't out of the way of them lions when they're... Oh, damn, I hope he's okay.